Hello guys, and welcome to another episode of Mass Effect Picoteering! I have no idea what the hell we actually were doing. And last time, oh yeah, we became a Spectre, so... I guess we need to just head back to the, the ship. I actually just remembered where we needed to go. We needed to go down here, in the CSEC. This is the guy we needed to talk to. Hello! Sec. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance Military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC Requisitions Officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Oh, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, yep. I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stock for you, Commander. Enjoy. And can buy this shit, but I can sell stuff. Yeah, I don't have any fucking money to that. Um, okay, let's just head up to the ship then. Here we go! What the hell? Okay, I don't know what Stelly uh, is talking about. I'm ready to go. Big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Yep. The perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Commander. What kind of leads do we have? Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got his Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharaohs and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording? She has a daughter, a scientist, who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Let's leave. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Saren's out there somewhere. And we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. If you got anything you want to say to the crew, now's the time. This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. This began with an attack on a human settlement in the Traverse. But we know Saren won't stop there. His Geth armies aren't going to stay on the far fringes of Citadel space. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. Wherever Saren goes, we'll follow. Wherever he searches for the conduit, we'll be there. We will hunt him to the very ends of the galaxy and bring him down. This is the most important mission any of us have ever been on. The fate of an entire galaxy is at stake. We will stop Saren, no matter what the cost. Well said, Commander. The captain will be proud. The captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Oh, man. Okay, I'm just gonna run around, talk to everybody and get uh, the trust or something like that. Oh, no, that's not in this one. We need to be focusing on that, but... Gonna hear the crew out and talk to them. Hey, Commander, you know that Quarian Tally? She's been spending all her time down here asking me about our engines. I'll tell her to leave you alone. What? No, she's amazing. I wish <laughs> you guys were half as smart as she is. Of course, Sally. She'll know more about our engines than I do. She's got a real knack for technology, that one. I can see why you wanted her to come along. I figured she'd be a real asset to the team. You've got an eye for Tally, Commander. But I'm guessing that's not why you came down here. Okay, let's go talk to Tally. Tally's just working miracles down here. Your ship's amazing, Shepard. I've never seen a drive cord like this before. I can't believe you were able to fit it into a ship this small. I'm starting to understand why you humans have been so successful. I had no idea Alliance vessels were so advanced. The Normandy's a prototype. 
Cutting edge technology. A month ago, I was patching a makeshift fuel line into a converted tug ship in the flotilla. Now, I'm sitting on board one of the most advanced vessels in Citadel space. I have to thank you again for bringing me along. Traveling on a vessel like this is a dream come true okay, for me. Okay, now I talk to Tally and everybody else, and so then we can head uh, to Liara, right? I think that's where we're going. I seriously hope that um, Garrison and uh, Tally are gonna show up in uh, the next game, uh, the fourth one, the new one that's coming. It's uh, not coming soon though, but they're working on it. I hope they they got a bang back. We know Liara is definitely gonna come back, so hope these uh, are as well. Here we go, let's fly away. A by Citadel. Here we go, I, f I really found the actual area we needed to go, where Liara is. Whoa, this looks so different, this area. It's so much better, this area, than first time I was here, man. <laughs> this looks so beautiful. The graphic was so old last time. But of course, I'd like me to go here. I really want to save my favorite game. One of I, th I think she is my favorite character in the game. Oh yeah, this thing can overheat. I forgot about that again. Remember, this thing can overheat. Need to re keep that in mind. Did I exit this thing? Oh, I'll find out. Okay. Need to head in here. Gonna activate this. Where's this more? That was close. Closer than I, that I wanted. This time I'm taking the shotgun in here. And I gotta stay in cover. Gonna run down here. Come on, run, 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 run. That did some damage. That did a lot of damage. If I'm not mistaken, there's one more in here. Does not. Nice. Okay, now the back door is open as well. What the... Maybe I should have shut down these guys first. Uh, bad decision of me. Get Tally, get back up. That didn't help Tally. Uh, Tally? Guess Tally not conscience there. Um, guess I'm just supposed to leave Tally then. Got a big one here. Go! Boom. Get knocked down. Go down. Seriously, go down. Thank you. Made it to the area. Okay, uh, cover, 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 cover. And then we definitely need the sniper here. Gotta run for it! There we go, got him. I can't believe how pretty overpowered this uh, pistol is, actually. So on Insanity, I can't revive my mates. Seems like I can't. They get knocked down, then staying knocked down. I'm saving right here, because I know I'm probably gonna die up to this thing here. I have no idea. I don't remember how to take this fun beast down here. So this can end terrible. We have trouble, guys. This is not good. That's not the thing I'm worried about. That's the thing I'm worried about. This is gonna end terrible. Here we go. Got the big one down. Just these guys back here. Get them to float. Finally. Fuck man, that was a tough fight. Do not fucking die here. Screw you, man. You're not gonna kill me now. Oh, made it finally, man. That took a while, actually. <laughs> I died sometimes. But we made it. Shit. Let's go. 
run right around here and get them. Here we go. God damn it. Okay, I glitched totally out there. I oh, fought the other one was dead there. Holy hell. Coast call, coast call. Uh, it broke. Hello? Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. Liara to Sony, I presume. Thank the goddess. I did not think anyone would come looking for me. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, all right? There's some kind of propulsion field in the way. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. You shouldn't have been messing with technology you don't understand. I wasn't going to let the Geth capture me. Besides, I know how it works. Mostly. There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. Oh my god, there they are. Seems to be stuck down there. Oh, uh, there we go. We're just heading down. Sniper down. And I shot too fast again. I needed to shoot faster, though. There you go. Bye. Okay, now we need to go and turn this thing on. Got it! Here we go. Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We blasted through with the mining laser. Of course. Yes, that makes sense. Please, get me out of here before more Geth arrive. That button over there should shut down this containment field. Wait, Commander. Can we trust her? Her mother's working with Saren. I am not my mother. I don't even... I don't know why Benezia joined Saren. I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard. If she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on. I, oh, I nice to have Leora back. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit, but I don't know. What the hell is that? These Time to go. Are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA, eight minutes. He needs to move faster. Going up. Rogan. Uh, bad. We don't have time to deal with this idiot. Charge! <sighs> I like your attitude. Reset! <laughs> Got wrecked there. Over here, guys. Come on. That's a goddamn rocket. That hurt. There we go. 
one more. Can believe it. Oh man, the Krogan was insanely strong, man. I got wrecked by him so much, man. Time to go, guys. I need to hurry. Run. Commander, ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy um. isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost okay. died out there, and your pilot is making jokes. Sometimes Joker's a real ass. Just try to ignore him. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there. And not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. Ah, oh, guess who that's? Yes. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But yep. I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, this isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Of course, you're right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, <laughs> I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her bionics will come in handy when the fighting starts. We've already got every other non-human species on board. Might as well add an Asari to the team. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate? Or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion. Coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. 
It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? We can talk again after you've seen the Doctor. The rest of you, dismiss. Yeah. I just want to end it here. End it here. We're going to talk to Liara in the next one. I'm going to say thank you for joining me for another episode. This was a tough uh, battle here in the end. But I don't think I struggled that much more. That ending fight is a boss fight in the end. I struggled with, I remember. But this one I definitely also struggled with the first time. So it's going to be pretty much easier from here on out if I'm not remembering right. Uh, okay. But uh, I'm just going to end it here. I'm going to say thank you for watching. And see you guys in the next episode. Bye.